Hi, I'm Pastor Goodman. And this is the Lord who God's life. So tense matters. Past, present, future tense. You know that stuff, right? But the thing is, some things started in the past and kept going. It matters that they're still happening. For example, I put on pants this morning. But the difference between saying I was wearing pants and I am wearing pants is whether or not I get kicked out of Target. See, both were true, but what matters is that it's still happening. So when it comes to baptism, much like your pants, well, if it does what God says it does, it's too important to leave it stuck in the past. It's too important to say I was baptized. We need to say I am baptized. In the large catechism, Luther writes, This I say, lest we fall into the opinion in which we were for a long time, imagining that our baptism is something past which we can no longer use after we have fallen again into sin. The reason is that it is regarded only according to the external act once performed and completed. So, I was baptized, it's true. But for today, even more importantly, I am baptized. It was a good day when I was baptized, but the thing is, I've had a lot of bad days since. Baptism was for those bad days after. Baptism is for this day right now. It is a daily washing and renewal. It is a daily hope and joy. It is a gift that keeps on giving. It started in the past, but it just keeps right on going. And so I am baptized, not just for the good day when it happened, but for every day after, unto eternity, so that on my very worst days, God would equip me with something that shelters me from the stains of sin, something that gives me something to look to other than the shame of, well, myself. Something that names me exactly what I am in God's eyes. Something that cannot be changed in a world where so much else does. I am baptized and so I am holy and I am worthy of love because God has made me that way. He has done it many years ago in my baptism, but that carries forward to this day and evermore through all of eternity. You are baptized because this gift that God gave you, it still works. And so in Luther's large catechism, he would keep on going and say, thus it appears what a great excellent thing baptism is, which delivers us from the jaws of the devil and makes us God's own, suppresses and takes away sin, and then daily strengthens the new man, and is and remains ever efficacious until we pass from this estate of misery to eternal glory.